What do you think is particularly Irish about the song? Me. <laughs> A lot of people are actually telling me that they're surprised that this is coming from Austria, so I'm excited to surprise everyone. The song is about the struggle that we take in our lives to reach our goals. And what can I tell about us, about people from Poland, is that we never give up. So it has two languages, which are both official. Spoke, officially spoken in the country, um, so it's half French, half English, which I think really shows um, me, but also shows Luxembourg. Oh, I would say the, you know, Sweden have a lot of good pop music, and I would say this is a good pop song, so yeah, it's a banger. <laughs> I'd say honesty, because we tend to be honest and uh, in our expressions. Melodies in my song are very Italian. Oh, everything about our performance and everything is Lithuanian. We, we chose to write the song in Lithuanian language. It's a beautiful language. We want the world to, to see it, to listen to it. Also, everyone that works on our team is Lithuanian. Uh, we have a few people that live abroad, but they're Lithuanian as well. So from head to toe, everything is like Lithuanian made and yeah. The song is about the first woman that was tried as a witch in my country, so I think that's very Slovenian. <laughs> Our outfits represent Croatia. So, yeah, and the whole story. I mean, in a sense that we're leaving our country for a better life, so that's that's the main thing. You have the, the calling in, in the chorus. That's an old traditional um, way of singing they use up in the mountains. Uh, to call their to call their animals back to the farm. A bit of a group that's seen the vertical. They give you that.